this right now it's team usa who's out on top i'm sure this has not been the start the nba stars were expecting but team usa came out swinging it right now they're in control i love how he challenged the shot that takes some guts near the hoop Turner dishes to Jordan. Tries again. Offensive rebound. Ewing the pass to Turner. Now, here is Jordan. Turner trying to free himself up. Ewing finds Turner. Jordan with the ball. Missed it. Even after all those chances. They need to find a high percentage shot, Clark, to regain some of that confidence. I think they've gone too long without seeing one go down, and that begins to mess with your psyche. Here's McHale, and that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Mike, we're pretty far into this game. How do you like what you've seen so far from Michael Jordan? I gotta say, I'm impressed. Hmm. He's playing against some of the country's best pros and making a real impact out there. What a talent. Looking at who's out there now for the Stars. Robert Parrish has checked in for Williams. Bird comes in for Reed. Paxson, he's checked in for Whitman. And Thomas subbed in for C. Stink. Kicks it out to Mullen. Pass to Jordan. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Jordan's got 27. Efficiency personified there. Jordan scoring at will, taking over the game whenever he chooses. Pass to Bird from 20 feet out. Up again, controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Putting in the effort to get a second chance look. Nice. And with a decent amount of this game already gone, Michael Jordan has been coach just superb on offense. Yeah, this NBA star squad has not been able to shut him down. And he's outpacing Larry Bird in terms of scoring because of Can you believe what you just said? Outpacing Larry Bird. Man, it's amazing. That's saying a lot. Yeah. Something that's really making this game special is this crowd. I'm told it's over 60,000 people who packed in here to see Team USA take on the NBA stars. Hey, I'll get yours, I'll get yours. Oh. And slammed on by Jordan. MJ showing us all how it's done. The NBA stars trail by 19. Thomas kicks to Parrish. The pass to McHale. Over Perkins, trying to get open his berth. And he buries that one, drilling the rim on the way down. 60,000 people. I mean, that's enormous. For a rare look, Clark, it's so many amazing players. And Kevin, it's not surprising at all that many are salivating for this matchup. And I'm sure there are plenty of you folks at home who couldn't be here in person, but you're making just as much noise as these fans are in the building. And now we can enjoy it together. Me, Mike Clark, and all of you. Did you see that? Jordan putting on a show, folks. Enzo Thomas will bring it up for the Stars. Trailing by 19. Pass to McHale. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. You really can't overstate how many exciting rising stars there are on this Team USA roster. Dynamic college athletes, many of whom already have big NBA expectations attached to them. Aguayas checked in for Bird. Team USA also making some changes. Tisdale, he's checked in for Perkins. And Person subbed in for Mullen. Jordan passes to Tisdale. Here's Person. The shot. McHale with the rebound. McHale's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Guys like Perkins and Jordan and Ewing all seem like, to me, Clark, potential first-round picks. And I agree, Kevin, and it's a very interesting thought to consider while you watch how they handle these NBA stars. I mean, in some ways, this is like a first real taste of pro competition for these guys. Like, I could see Ewing going number one overall, and I could see Jordan, for instance, going in the top three or four picks. I don't have any arguments there. The devastating throw down by Parrish. Man, does he know how to pack a punch. 
pass to Person. Back to Jordan. Shoots it. Ewing trying to get open. And it comes off the front of the rim. The NBA stars trail by 15. Aguirre passes to Thomas. Aguirre with it. He's covered by Person. Team USA grabs the miss. Ewing's got six rebounds here tonight. Here's Jordan. Stars with the rebound. There's a player. And he was able to put it up in time, but doesn't fall. And that does it for the first half of play. Team USA leading by 15. Time now for the halftime break. Welcome back, everyone, for the second half of action in this exhibition game between Team USA and the NBA Stars. It has been a fun one so far. What stood out to me after a full first half of play is the sense of competition out there on the floor. The NBA stars aren't handling Team USA with kid gloves. They're giving their all. It's simple. You've got to get a body into your man. Box out if you want to rebound the ball. Defensive rebounding is about effort, trying, being willing to put a body on someone. On the court for the stars. Parrish is out there with Bird. Then it's Thomas. Then there's Aguirre. And it's Paxson in at the two. Michael Jordan on the wing. Aguirre covering. Jordan's shot is off. And Clark with Team USA. They don't seem to be holding anything back. Without question, if, if these young guys are intimidated by playing against pros, they're not showing any signs of that. And you know, it's not so easy to have to go up against the guys you're accustomed to looking up to, Kevin. That takes a lot of confidence. A lot of guts, you're right. Pass to Alford. Now Mullen. Jordan looking it over. And the rejection by Parrish. A little taste of NBA level defense for Jordan there. He can't expect to get every look he wants. One half gone coach and you have to admit Jordan has looked good matched up against some of these NBA stars. Oh, absolutely. He's attacking when he wants and finding himself shots. Showing no fear against some talented NBA defenders. And Jordan gets it to go. I like that they're putting in the work trying to build this lead out. Because in the NBA, no lead is safe. Outside Thomas. Paxson outside. The pass to Bird. Tries from 16. Alford with the rebound. Well, there wasn't much there in terms of defensive pressure. I'm sure he'd like another crack at that shot. Here's Jordan. Perkins trying to break loose. A nice shot by Jordan. Jordan's got 37. So, Coach Rotello, as we get the second half going here, it's Team USA holding on to the lead. The problem is that might only further motivate the NBA stars. Being down to amateur players at this point in the game will really fire up their competitive spirit. That's going to be fun to watch. Team USA leading by 21. Ball, 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 ball. So it's Team USA on a run currently getting the best of the NBA stars for the moment. Playing well on both ends of the floor, stifling defense and dangerous O. That's a heck of a combo. That's what has built this lead. Trying to end the drought. Misses off the left iron. He just can't seem to get anything to go. He's in a bit of a rut. He's got to simplify things on offense. Concentrate on getting quality looks and not settling for bad shots. Even with the score where it is, he just keeps coming. Coach, they're ice cold on the offensive end. Well, something has to change. Bird, the pass to Aguirre. It's stolen by Mullen. You know, I find this an interesting challenge that all of these players have to deal with. Playing with a coach they're not quite familiar with. NJ. That can be more challenging than it seems when you haven't had a lot of practice time to build up a relationship there. Outside Thomas passes it to Aguirre. Over Mullen. And that one goes long. 
Tell you what, you can feel their frustration underneath the surface. It's actually palpable with all these misses. They're trying to shake it off, but every time they come up short, the panic starts to set in. They're not just on fire. Nothing is getting in their way on offense. It's practically supernatural. The defense is trying everything. And once again, off the mark by the Stars. Mike, you can speak about this, but I've always thought it's an interesting dynamic when players have a new or temporary coach in control. It's really all about respect. As a player, you have to respect what the coach is trying to do. And as a coach, you have to respect that the players aren't fully accustomed to your style and be patient with them. Sounds like communication key. This is what he brings to your team. The ability to turn misses into makes. Pile up second chance points. Here's Bird. Their offense stone cold. Another miss there. A lot of this game already in the books. And offensively, Coach, Michael Jordan has been putting on a show. Finding shot after shot after shot. And taking a big scoring lead over Larry Bird. I really think this NBA Stars Defense unit was just unprepared for Jordan. Maybe they thought an amateur would be easy to guard. Well, maybe they did. I don't know. It has been interesting, though, hasn't it? Free throw good, Jordan. You know, there's so much that's amazing to me about Jordan, but his endurance stands out. He consistently gets stronger, it seems, as the game goes on. And the Stars going with a whole new group out there now. Team USA also making some changes. Ewing comes in for Sam Perkins. And Konkak is subbed in for Tisdale. It was the pick setting up that slam. A oh, great team ball. Yeah, everyone on the same page. Here's Jordan. And he finishes nicely on the way. Jordan's got 16 here in the second half. Relentless. You make contact with Jordan, it doesn't affect him at all. Williams trying to break free, misses in close. And so Jordan will bring it up for Team USA. They've only allowed two points so far here in the second half, and it's good for two. All too easy for Jordan, just unfazed by anything the defense throws at him. He's got an answer. Pass to McHale. Shot left block, and it's blocked. And it's out of bounds. The Stars able to retain possession here. And we have to take another glance at that powerful rejection. Reads the play well there and gets himself in the air at just the right time. Terrific denial. Substitution on the court. Well, most of this game behind us now, and all you can say about Michael Jordan's performance, Mike Fratello is, wow, I mean, what a show he has put on against these NBA stars. He certainly does look league ready, doesn't he? Oof. You can just see why fans are so excited about Jordan's potential as part of an NBA team. I mean, he's got everything. Here's Jordan. Good on the shot. Jordan's got 53. What a game for Michael Jordan thus far. He's played very competitively against players who are literally in another league. To the inside. Williams passes to Woodson. Here is Seasting. Pass to Woodson. Now Reed. He's looking for McHale and finds him. Goes up. Alford with the rebound. And so, Coach, it's Team USA currently in the lead with most of this game now behind us. Give a lot of credit to the young guys of Team USA for being in this position. But they can't take their foot off the gas now because the NBA stars will play hard right up until the buzzer. Whitman is checked in for the Stars. Turner's checked in for Team USA. Reynolds comes in for Alford. Jordan is doubled. And there's the pass to Reynolds. Jordan inside. Good. Jordan's got 55. As they keep expanding this lead, keep feeding him the ball. He's having a great shooting night, so yeah, I'd say getting him the rock is a great game plan. Passes it to Woodson. 
Reed with it. He's against Turner. Again, the miss by the Stars. It's been a one-sided affair for sure. It is obvious and clear who the better team is. And Jordan gets it to go. The quickness of Jordan. He's got a tremendous first step. You know, every player wants to win a game they're playing in. But in this matchup, there's some extra pride and motivation on the line. These NBA stars want to put the next generation in check. And Team USA wants to show us they're ready for the lead. We go now to David Aldridge as this game enters the home stretch. Kevin, thanks very much. Now, this intensity is real right now. Everybody can sense it. Everyone's playing hard and trying to win this game. USA wants to prove they're the next best thing, while the NBA stars want to keep their spot on top of the mountain. Back to you guys. Great stuff, DA. Thank you very much. Mike, it's, uh, it's exciting in here tonight, isn't it? It is, and if you're one of the 60,000 fans in this building, you are loving it. These players are putting on a show. It's been fun to see. It is indeed. Pass to Williams. Here's Woodson. Pass to Bird. To stop the run, and he knocks down the jumper. That cry on the line certainly has added some extra mic intensity to this game. You can just see it in the eyes of the players, especially here late in the game. This game might not count for the record books, but these teams are hungry to prove that they can get the better of each other. This has really been fun. Here is Seasting. Here's Whitman. Again, the starting score. You know, Seasting's job is to get the ball to open teammates. Great dime right there. Outside Jordan. And they double up Jordan. Reynolds. Good, and the assist goes to Jordan. He sees an opening and takes it. Moving the ball inside and into the hands of a guy ready to score. Here is Seasting. Here's Bird. Again, the Stars score. This has been classic Bird all night so far. Scoring with ease and just knocking down shots on Team USA. Here's Jordan. Oh, and the jam by Jordan. And the high-flying antics of Jordan, simply awesome. Here is Seasting. The pass to Bird. Shoots over Turner. Team USA grabs the miss. We've got 148 left to play here in the second half. Jordan passes to Turner. Back to Jordan. NBA stars try to stop him, but no. A great dunk by Jordan. Boy, what a ruthless, wicked dribble move that time by Jordan. Threw his defender off and got the space he needed to fire. Passes to Woodson. Just his first attempt. And Conkac pulls it down. I know, Mike, you love how guys are making plays for one another, and we've seen it all game long. Yeah, a real balanced attack. Total team effort. They get it back. Here's Jordan. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. We've seen this from Jordan before. He lurks around the offensive glass. To the right side. And stolen by Jordan. Pass to Reynolds. Back to Jordan. Bird pulls it in. Pass to Seasting. Back to Bird. Here is Seasting. Puts it up from 12. The putback. It's good on the putback. Willing to fight for those loose balls. Bird is a winner. 32 seconds left in the game. Jordan outside. He kicks it to Turner. Back to Jordan. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Such a physical player. Jordan seems to embrace getting contact on the way up. Shooting two. Oh, 
And he knocks down the first one on the court. And so Jordan nails both of them. 12 seconds left in the second half of basketball. Here is Zesting. And so it's Team USA who is able to capture a win over the NBA stars in this exhibition contest. Mike, what a game we just saw. You have to respect what Team USA was able to accomplish here. Going up against top-tier competition and managing to come away with the win. And the NBA stars taking a loss in Clark that luckily doesn't go on any of their records. Yeah, I doubt that makes it sting any less, though, Kevin. Getting shown up and beaten by young guys is going to leave a bad taste in your mouth. But like we said, a terrific performance by Team USA. You got to give them credit. Yep, they went the distance. For our terrific reporter, David Aldridge, along with Clark Kellogg and Mike Fratello, I'm Kevin Harlan saying thank you for tuning in tonight. So long, everyone.